Hi, I'm Ebony G. Patterson, and I am at the National Museum of Art, uh, where my show, While the Dew is Still on the Roses, is currently on view. So in many ways, I think about the work as the flower and the audience as the bees. That in many ways, the bee is first attracted to the flower because of its color, but it's not until you start peeling back the layers that you understand what's happening with the nectar. Beneath all of the layers, beneath the shine, beneath the patterns, beneath the embellishment, sits an uneasy question. The question is whether or not you choose to look for this. Spend time looking before you take a picture. We spend a lot of time behind a camera rather than engaging with the subjects that are in front of that camera. And we get so caught up in needing to capture a moment rather than making space for the moment that we're um, attempting to hold in the devices that are slipped in our pockets. Um, the exhibition is about making space. Um, so what I'm asking the audience to do when they come here is not to just take time, but to make space. Because we are a little superficial sometimes. Uh, many of us will come into the exhibition and we'll be enamored with the prettiness of things, the floral, the fauna, uh, the patterns within the work. Um, but in order to get beneath those layers, um, that's all just a, a ploy to seduce the audience into looking. Um, and so I'm asking you to go beneath and between uh, the beauty. Uh, because one of the things that I'm really interested in having people do is engaging in the act of looking. There's a difference between seeing and looking. Seeing is incredibly superficial. It is about the surface, but looking also incorporate seeing, uh, but the key thing that looking also, um, also involves is questioning. It requires a dig. It requires questions. So the eyes are engaged in looking, but so is the brain in asking what's here, what's happening, and what are we looking at.